three people on. What's up guys, my name is Trevor. Welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel where we have daily vlogs now. And we are on our way to 1,000 subscribers. And thanks to everybody out there that's already subscribed. And if you can, click that red subscribe button and get three of your friends to also subscribe. We'll be there in no time. So, lately today, well I mean lately, some stuff's been going on. And some things been hitting home on good old Tiki Talk. <laughs> and uh, I wanted to come out here and I, I just wanted to, to voice, to, to get this out. Somebody needed to hear this. And I hope it gets to the right person. And it might, it's not going to be for everybody and that's totally fine too. That is a beautiful Camaro right there. Oof. So, let's roll that intro and get into the meat and potatoes. All right, so lately I've I've been doing a lot of self-growth, but the thing is, is it would be nice to have a partner, you know, like a partner to a wife, uh, you know, somebody to help with the kids, somebody to help when I'm down. Luckily though, we don't really need that. It's just, it's one of those, it would be nice kind of things. Like, it'd be, it'd be great to have somebody's shoulder to cry on and just know that I'm not going home alone to an empty house. But these are times that are, are helping me grow and helping me learn about myself and about what what needs I really need and there's really there's only one and that's God I just need God and so eventually God's gonna place the right woman in my life at the right time and that is where I'm always led to I'm always led to that the right woman will show up at the right time as some of you might know, maybe not all of you, but I am hugely against getting into the dating apps. I've done it, and I've done it many times, and it's obviously, as you can tell, it's never worked out. And why is that? Well, I believe that that's because they're, they're not meant to be because I was the one searching for them. I was searching my my will, not God's will. It wasn't in God's plan, but I made it happen. Because he gave us free will. And so now, I just sit back and I'm like, you know what? Whew, that was almost a wreck, holy moly. I'm just like, you know, the lady of, of my dreams, of my life, She'll, uh, she'll find me one day. Our, our paths will cross. And, you know, I started thinking, well, maybe I've met her already. Like, maybe I already know this person. But there's, there's these little things that I've, from my past relationships, that now I, I like, hold on to that kind of like, man, I just don't want to, I don't want to let somebody in too fast. Because I'm here to tell you right now. If you, if you're really a parent and you're, you're, you look out for your kids like you should, you're not going to be going a date from one to the next in a day and have your kids around. And that is, that's my biggest problem with most of, most of the dating apps is that you talk to this girl, right? But you're like, hey, I, I can hang out this weekend. 
Well, if they can't, then, well, sorry, you, you just got pushed back another two weeks. You might have just got pushed back a month because uh, yeah, that doesn't work with, my, with me not having my boys. And so that's how I was doing it is I was like, look, we can hang out on these weekends. But uh, it, it just never panned out. Which led me again to God will place the right woman in my life at the right time. <laughs> and I'm gonna I'm gonna continue to repeat that because it is so true. It, I can't I guess I can't really I can't say that it's true, but I know it's true. I I believe it's true. I believe in his plan. And I know that one day, one day even you guys will see it. You'll be like, wow, Trevor. 29 years ago you said you're gonna have a wife man and look at you now <laughs> I mean who knows who knows I'm not even 29 now so that's it's pretty comical right but anyhow that's that's why I'm I don't date I don't date because I'm not I'm not going out looking for a girlfriend or a girl to go and have fun with every other night or every night or even to talk to daily I'm not looking for that because I want a wife I want a mother for my boys I now I realize yeah they have a mom but I want a mother in the house for my boys because believe it or not that's something that that I that me as a father I can't fill the the mother role I do my best and I, I do my best. Yeah, like you best believe I do my best. But you just can't feel a mother's love. They still crave a mother's love. And you know, they sure they get it from their mom, but it's not the same as if they were in the house living with us. And no, you're not moving back into my house ever, ever. So sorry I've just no we, we've, we've experienced that we did that no not again so <laughs> my my ex-wife is not going to come back into my house and what what really sucks is it goes the same way for single moms single moms can't fill the role of a father they can do their best and they can do really good at it, but they'll never feel the father's love. They'll never feel the father's spot. So, it it's definitely blunt both ways. It's not just one way. So that is another reason I don't date and I don't look for just a girlfriend because I want a mother for my children, just like I want a wife. But this wife has to be God-fearing. Because God comes first, and then comes yourself. So it's God, yourself, your spouse, and then your children. And everybody else falls on the fit. I I'm sorry, that's how it works. That's how it has to work. Because I, I, and I can attest to this. I have, I have put myself first, failed. I put my spouse first, I failed. I put my kids first. I failed. I put God first. And look at me now. Look at me now. Things are, things are, they're, oh, I, I wish I could just take my brain and show you guys, like, I know everything's going to be okay. I know everything's going to be great. I know that I don't have to worry about tomorrow. And I get to worry about today because God blessed me with today. And dang it, I'm going to use it. And I'm going to do my best to make sure that he gets all the glory. And I think I just forgot where I was going. I totally am going the wrong way. That's alright. Because it it's alright. These little, this is what I'm talking about. This is needed. It's needed. It needs to be said. And it needs to be, it needs to be heard but understood. So... Now that you've made it this far in the video, I'll go ahead and I'll tell you. I think I'm gonna use this for my dating applications. I'm gonna be like, 
oh, the girl shows that she's interested. I'm going to send her to watch this and be like, hey, you watch that and get back to me. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> what do you guys say? Yay or nay? Drop a comment down below and let me know. But if you like this video, smash that thumbs up. And also, help us hit 1,000 subscribers by clicking that red subscribe button. And after you've done that, tell three of your friends to subscribe. Tell three of your family members to subscribe. You know what? If you've already told three, go ahead and tell more. Help us grow the AV family because I appreciate each and every one of you. And you all mean so much to me. Now, I'm going to make my left turn here and uh, go the right direction. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> And I hope that you all have a wonderful day, a wonderful weekend, a wonderful night, a wonderful week, whichever it may be. We will catch you guys tomorrow in another Daily Arctic Vet Vlog. God bless. And we'll see you tomorrow. I'm really lost going this way, just so you know. I mean, I know where I'm going, but I'm lost because I'm like, my mind isn't caught up to my map yet. My map hasn't caught up to my mind yet. But here we are.